So what would happen if Mississippi just disappeared? When they aren't talking down on us, a lot of out-of-state folks just tend to forget we exist. Al Roker calls us the area east of Louisiana and west of Alabama. The Weather Channel calls us the landmass. And when I share lists of our historical achievements down here, a lot of times people respond with, well, sure, but what are you doing today? So let's explore that. Let's say that a DJ down in Jacksonville gets his hands on a Thanos glove, snaps his fingers, and the state of Mississippi ceases to exist. How quickly would people notice? Short answer? pretty quickly. The first place people would notice is at the dinner table. Mississippi feeds a lot of the country. Uh, for example, we're the third largest provider of poultry in the nation, and the United States eats a lot of poultry, over 38 billion pounds every year. America also eats over 140 million pounds of catfish every year, and we provide over half of the nation's domestic supply. Next, people would notice a pretty significant spike in prices at the store, from groceries and plastics to clothing and other items. The lack of our soybeans, cotton, lumber, and animal feed would drive supply down and demand up, making things a lot more expensive. Without Mississippi, nearly $8 billion of those crops would vanish. The soybeans alone would cause a major spike because soybeans are used in everything from printer ink to paint to glue to candles. You name it, soybeans are probably there. That's also assuming that you could find any of these items on the shelf, and that's questionable without Mississippi. Mississippi plays a big role in import-export with the port of Gulfport uh, processing over 2.3 million pounds of cargo every year. Think back to 2020 when all the transportation routes were in disarray and how empty the shelves were. It would be like that in a lot of places. And then just getting to the store would get more expensive. Gas prices would spike as our natural gas and oil production went away. And the spike in diesel prices would make the items at the store even more expensive. Of course, this would also be true for just about any state that disappeared. So what's something that Mississippi offers that very few other states also offer? Let's start with national defense. Losing Mississippi would severely weaken our naval capabilities. Well over half of the Navy's ships are built here in Mississippi. And that's not including the maintenance that we do on existing ships. And not only would the country lose the facilities that we use to do these things, we'd lose the people that know how. Space flight for America would also essentially grind to a halt without our Stennis Space Center. NASA as well as private space companies like SpaceX would lose their ability to test their launch systems and their rocket engines without Stennis. Not only would this cripple a lot of exploration plans like a manned mission to Mars, but it would also impact our ability to put satellites in space, which would have a communications impact nationwide. With our universities gone, hundreds of millions of dollars of research would also grind to a halt. This includes research into everything from marine biology to agriculture, sustainable farming, veterinary science, and engineering. Without our medical training centers, the nationwide shortages of nurses and doctors would only worsen. America would also feel the absence of our medical research. We already led the nation in organ transplant breakthroughs and in HIV treatment research. Who knows what other future breakthroughs would be eliminated if we weren't here. Not to mention, life would just get a lot more boring. I mean, imagine the country without our Mississippi athletes, without our authors, without our actors, without our musicians, without our recipes, and think about the wealth of knowledge and history that would go away without us. Obviously, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Feel free to keep this list going in the comments section, but this gives a little bit of an idea of what the world would look like if the Magnolia State weren't here. This may not keep people from ripping on us, but it's always nice to know just how much they need us.